But if the idea is that a lot of these influencers are following the trend, that means being masculine, have traditional values is now the trend. It is. Isn't that actually positive for society that these women are doing these things because they weren't doing it five years ago? A hundred percent. It's amazing that they're saying these things. Mm. It's amazing that we've changed the culture. I believe I was part of that. Trump was part of mm. that. You saying the right thing is part of that. What is cool now wasn't cool three years ago. Things are changing. I'm not complaining that they're making this content. I'm yeah. glad they are. My question is, how true are their core beliefs? And then you go deeper down the rabbit hole into the semi-misogyny area where mm. people are going to have a panic attack. How true is any woman's core belief mm. when she can't defend the belief? You go deeper down the rabbit hole, you understand. If you're not prepared to defend an idea, you don't hold an idea. If you're not prepared to stand up to people who disagree with you and defend it vigorously, then you've never held it in the first place. If you can't defend it, it's not yours. So a lot of women, when they're challenged openly because they fear societal pressure, they feel all being ostracized, they feel being criticized, they, they, they don't want to be insecure, they fear these things, and because they're not brave enough to deal with the consequences of holding a controversial idea, no woman's going to jail for her idea. Mm. I did. Name a chick who's going to go sit with the cockroaches for 93 days in a Romanian dungeon for her idea on YouTube. Hmm. Name one. Not a single one. They're pussies. As they should be. They're women. I don't want women to be as brave as me. Hmm. So they're scared. So if you're a woman and you can be scared out of saying certain things, and you're scared of being criticized for certain things, and you're scared of physical confrontation, and you're scared of being ostracized, do you even believe anything? Do you really believe it? This is, this is, a, this is a philosophical question. Yeah. Do you truly believe it? You may believe it when you say it, but there's a difference between believing something when it's convenient and it's soft and it's easy and believing something when it's hard. They're very different things. I know my beliefs are core to my heart. I know that I believe them because I will suffer for them. If you don't suffer for your idea, do you believe it?